Hey guys, it's Josh from Austin Underground, and I'm here with Brainsford at South by Southwest 2017. How are you doing? I'm pretty well. How are you? I'm doing pretty well as well. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> so um, this is your first South by, and how has it like been treating you so far? Um, well, I only got in last night, and so far I've just done a lot of press, so mm-hmm. it's been good. <laughs> Not like the typical experience, but um, I think I'm going to get out and like see some shows and stuff after my showcase today, so... Awesome. Looking forward to that, yeah. So it's been very busy for you. I'm sure it has all the press. Yeah. Um, what are some like artists are you looking forward to seeing, like, the, when you're like not performing shows, not doing press? Is there any artists that you would like to see? Um, well, I was hoping I was gonna be able to see Banks last night, but I ended up getting in too late. Um, I'm not super. I'm like, kind of just gonna like go with the flow tonight. But I think like mm-hmm. Betty Who and Friendship are playing. Um, so I don't know. I'm just gonna like do whatever my friends want to do I think <laughs> like I think you know everything here is so good so I'm sure whatever we happen upon will be a good time awesome so where did the name like Rainsford come from because I know it's like a part of your name as well but yeah Rainsford is actually my full first name and it was a it's a family name I was named after my great-grandmother great-great-grandmother okay cool so you go like by rainy as like a nickname or exactly sure. yeah okay because Rainsford yeah. is kind of a mouthful but it's also <laughs> I think hopefully memorable so th- yeah. that's why <laughs> awesome yeah so how did you get started in the music industry um well I grew up in a pretty creative household um and then I started dancing when I was two and my parents put me in piano lessons and my dad plays guitar so he taught me to play guitar um and really I think dance was super influential for me because um when you're dancing you kind of experience music in obviously in like a more physical way and kind of in your full body rather than just listening to it you're like kind of become part of it and so it's, I feel like that's been in me since the time I can remember um and I always just really loved singing and um I don't know I just never wanted to do anything else awesome yeah so, um you talked about like how dance has influenced you but mm-hmm. has, um is there any like in a, like musical influences like other artists who have influenced you to become a music, uh, musician absolutely yeah I think I am inspired by different kinds of artists for different reasons like vocally I um, have always really loved kind of like older musicians like Motown and soul stuff like I love The Temptations and Diana Ross and Marvin Gaye um, and then for like sorry we should probably there's like loud <laughs> um Anyway, yeah, and then for, like, more modern stuff, that's kind of, I think, where I get inspired for, like, kind of my writing style and production. Um, so I listen to so many different kinds of people, like like Shura and Wet and Samfa and Ink and Rihanna and Tame Impala and, like, I don't know, just, like, so many different people. Uh, and I think that's it's such an exciting time for music because... Uh, especially with it being much easier to kind of be an independent artist, I think there's, like like so much weird music out there that like typically I probably or like most people wouldn't really find out about but like because of like the internet because of like the freedom of being an artist now it's like so available mm-hmm. and how, how would you like describe your sound and music um I would just I would say it's like weird pop R&B <laughs> <laughs> So I saw that you like also model on the side, uh, model on the side, kind of. Um, can you tell us about that? Yeah, I mean, I I act and model a little bit as well. Like music is definitely my primary focus, but um, I love a lot of art forms, like um, dance. I already mentioned, and like I paint too. And so I kind of think that um, as an artist, like being able to do different things and kind of like have different I guess forms of art like share with each other and like influence different areas of your life can like makes your art more full Mm -hmm. yeah so um I I also saw that you have like an EP coming out like later this year yeah Um, could you tell us a little bit more about that yeah absolutely um I think it's probably going to come out in the next two months Mm -hmm. um it's going to be like six songs and it's going to be fucking dope. <laughs> no, I don't know. I mean, hopefully. Awesome. I think it's great. <laughs> I'm sure, I'm sure yeah. it will be. Um, what, what can fans expect like, from the EP? Um, it's, like, I don't know. What do you mean, like, expect in what way? Like, I, I'm sure some, some, some of your fans have already like, heard some of your songs, but is there, like, any, anything new that they will be, like, uh, listening to from the EP? Yeah, I mean, there's going to be, like, new songs and, 
Like, there's a couple of them are, like, more, like, <laughs> one of them is, like, more, like, upbeat and kind of sounds like, <laughs> I don't know, like a, like a, when my producer sent it to me, like, after we wrote it, he, like, vibed it out a lot more and he was like, it sounds like, like a 70s porno soundtrack, <laughs> so, <laughs> but that's not, like, the whole vibe, that's just, like, one song, and then there's some that's kind of, like, there's one that's, like, a stripped down, kind of, like, almost Frank Ocean-y kind of thing, and I don't know, it's, like, you know, it's, it's, there's, n there's not, they're not all the same, you yeah. know. <laughs> Great. Um, so one last quick question. Um, if there was, like, any ar artists you can collaborate, like, from right now, like, in the future, which artists would those be? I have so many artists that I would love to collaborate with. Um, like, I mean, obviously, like, really successful artists like Rihanna or, like, Tame Impala or Drake or um, Lana Del Rey would be awesome. But, or, like, I don't know. It's, there's so many people, like, Jack Garrett would be really cool, or Gallant, um, or like Laney, or um, I don't know. There's I like I love music, and there's a lot of musicians I love. Awesome. Well, yeah. um, thank you for taking your time here and talking with us, and we wish you good luck on your EP later out this year, and we hope you have a great rest of South by Southwest. Thank you. You too. <laughs>